So over the last week and a half, we've been meeting the top nine finalists for the Sports Edge on the Scene host. And today, we introduce to you the last contestant, Nate Brown. Nate, welcome to Connecticut Style, and congratulations for getting this far. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me. Let's learn a little bit about Nate. Tell us about yourself. All right. I'm originally from Middletown, Connecticut, born and raised. Uh, I graduated from Springfield College a little early. I did it in three and a half years. I uh, graduated this December and majored in communications and sports journalism. And I'm just I'm looking for that foot in the door. So this job is right up your alley then, right? Yes, exactly. <laughs> Perfect. Good experience. So I understand you're the founder of Springfield College Television. Yes. What's that all about? It's a um, big undertaking. Yes. Coming in my freshman year, we didn't have a up and running, you know, TV studio. There was just we had one there, but nobody was doing anything with it. And over my time there, uh, we accumulated enough technology, enough support that the fall of my senior year, I was able to jumpstart the new station, and we had a you know full half hour running new show weekly. And um, I you know I, I did leave in December, but you know they they kept it going, and it's it's grown. You which left your mark. I, I left my mark, which <laughs> which was awesome and it, it, you know it was great to leave that behind for them and hopefully they'll keep it going. All right so right now you're writing for NBA rookie class what's that about? That is a website that I had to start as a class project it was you know hey start a website about mm -hmm. something you're interested in and uh, I just decided you know what I'm a huge fan of the sport of basketball you know game seven the finals everything's <laughs> gonna be great and um, I, I just figured you know with Kemba Walker coming out of UConn with Andre Drummond coming out of UConn big names in this state, right, right right big talent you know locally so I figured you know what Let, let's go for NBA rookies and it's it's been fun to write about um, not you know just just something to do and sure. um, it, it's been great it's been enjoyable and you were an intern at another station we won't talk about okay. that but you must have had a lot of great experience yes yes I've I've had wonderful opportunities last year I was actually able to go to the Jim Calhoun charity all-star game oh, cool. and help interview with that I've been to the Travelers Championship before so several opportunities looking for more so yeah. we'll see hopefully something comes up all right here's the big question Nate what makes you the next sports edge on the scene host sure um, I would like to think I'm a very good innovator um, um, you know, having jump started SCTV3 sure. and having started my own website, uh, I, re I really enjoy helping to build things and you know, bring them to the next level. And um, it's something that, with this new position of being the host of Sports Edge on the Scene, hopefully yeah. it's something that I can help improve. And I like we'll the see. sound of that, Nate. All Best right. of luck to you. Well, you, you can vote for your favorite finalist. Just go to sportsedge.com. We're in the kitchen with everyone. You mm -hmm. added some bananas, well, didn't yes, you, here Heidi? Here they are, three bananas uh, to make the banana pudding. We're going to give Hence us a very name. quick start. <laughs> Hence the name, banana pudding. And who would like some? I'm going to try some. Okay, great. Guys, <laughs> nice. thank you all so much for being here. Tom, thanks so much as well. And uh, we're out of time. We're going to send it back over to Dance and Life for an encore performance. Everyone have a great day. Bye-bye. Thank you. Hello. Here are my little dancers who are going to demonstrate some movement based on this Chinese calligraphy strokes. Now we have Carolina. I'm going to demonstrate hook. Nice job, Carolina. Vivian, let's have a little bit and do a right falling. Good, nice. All right, the code are gonna do two strokes, hook and right falling all together. Yes, nice. Okay, Dorothy is going to demonstrate hook and folding. Nice, I like Dorothy taking her time. Good job. Now, Brielle is going to do that and right falling. All right, good job, everyone. Now, let's try some fun dance. You can start with your stroke and then improv after. Ready? Here we go, let's stand up and move. Watch out. 